Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. We are back with more of Watch Dogs 2. This should be the final part to Caustic Progress and the final episode of our playthrough of Watch Dogs 2. Let's go on up here and talk with, uh, I guess we have a dead sick operative up here. Let's see what he has to say. Good to see you. Yeah, same. So, fill me in. What have you found? Honestly, looks like your standard run-of-the-mill medical clinic. They do have some computers set up, of course. Expect you'll find more info once you hack into their system. And the doctors carry around these data pads. Those probably have info, too. Seems likely. I'm gonna see what I can get off the doctor's data pad. Good call. <laughs> okay. Oh, we didn't say oh. All right. Um I guess we can actually walk over here. So yeah, the first part of this um caustic progress, we wearing our shuffler outfit and there's absolutely no action involved in that first part, which is very disappointing. Come on. Ubisoft, really. Hmm. Alright, let's see. Where can I hide? Is that a jammer? What is that over there? Uh 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 uh! You don't see me. You don't see me. You know, I'm tired of this detected stuff, these false detections. So I can't. Okay, maybe he didn't One have down. a cell phone. I mean, I, like, why? Why wouldn't that work to distract him? Looks like the police are trying to keep this whole thing pretty quiet. Yeah. News stations are being told it's some sort of minor illness among the homeless population. Regular citizens shouldn't be worried. Right. Who cares about the homeless? All the deaths do seem to occur within a three-mile radius of known mobile clinic locations.
We are finally I'll out meet of you here. you at the Rensense building. Sounds good. Anyone else want in on this? Wrench and Satara are working on their own projects. <laughs> cool. So I'll meet you there and we'll see what we can do about freeing some people and destroying some nanobots. It's a plan. All right. That part of the mission is completed. Wait for it. Keep waiting for it. There we go. Meet Josh at the Rensense lab. All right, let's see where that's located. Oh, okay, really? Um, map? Okay, so we're back over here. So we did get to use the shuffler powers a little bit in the last mission. Hey, thanks for letting me come along, Marcus. <laughs> yeah, sure thing, man. Nanotech is pretty cool. It'd be fascinating to see what they're doing. Except, of course, they should be doing it ethically. Well, aren't and... you the cutest thing? Gee, thanks, Lenny. I didn't know you felt that way, except I really don't want to go into your spank pen. Not you, shitcake. Little Mr. Spectrum here. Me? Oh. You don't mean me. Yeah, he can't go into your spank bank either. Oh, I just want to pinch your little cheek. Oh, please don't. Oh, you're like a little puppy. I always wanted a puppy. Do you want to come work for me? No. What do you want, Lenny, uh, besides harassing Josh? Oh, you are no fun at all. I want what I've always wanted, whatever Ren sense is hiding in there. They are beyond the cutting edge of transhumanism. They are the bleeding edge. Oh, fuck your pansy-ass sensibilities. I was right about the homeless people, wasn't I? You need me. I know access codes. I know how their systems work. Yeah? Why'd you call DedSec, then? Because I need human shields? That's not very nice. Well, I'm not very nice. Except to you, sugar. Oh, you are wasting your time with those D-bags. See, the thing is, I have the Super brain. Super creepy. I just need the brawn and someone to back me up in the hacking. And even though Captain Butt fuck annoys the piss out of me, he can hack his way out of a paper bag. I'm flattered. Well, whatever. We gonna do this or what? Okay, so, uh, <laughs> I was thinking, Josh and I... No, 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 we're not risking him. Sugar Plum stays put. But... Nope, it is just the two of us. Unless you're not up to the challenge. You're totally <laughs> gonna turn on me after this, aren't you? <gasps> of course I am. And what is up with you and Josh? He reminds me of someone. I just really wanted to see the nanotech. Oh, sweetie. I will let you look at any nanotech I liberate, okay? I promise. So creepy. Move it, shit widget. Shit widget? Move! All right, man. 
And did we ever find out what that key is that Josh is wearing around Bye. his neck? I don't remember anything ever being said about it. And that's a shame. That's another part of this game that I dislike so much. The characters are never developed. Looks like this is the research lab. Finally. Oh, I'm hurt, Lenny. I thought we were having a moment. Ah, oh, don't flatter yourself. You're breaking my heart. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, can you imagine the sheer quantity of that man in the right here? You should have known. Like being a kid in a candy shop. Hey, we're here Why to help. Why are these people. purple? Oh, I'm all about helping people. And guess what? I'm a people. Oh, is this a this is a competition? What is? Nope, I'm good. Wait, what is this? All right, never mind. What? You want to know why I'm here? Why I care about this shit? Because it can make us better. So hey, those are all nice ideas, but I'm not buying it. You think the world can continue like it is forever? You think we are about to burn up the planet with wars and waste? Nanotech can clean up the environment, repurpose the toxic shit we're putting into the air on the fucking time and make it useful. That may be, but that's not what Rensense was doing and you know it. They were trying to come up with cool toys for rich people to buy and they were using poor people's lives to do it. paint dry a lot, Lenny. Oh, we're done. All right, you go hack the computer on the right side of the room and open the door. Sure. Want me to order you a pizza while I'm at it? Ha, funny. Just do your job. Who's right? My right? Come on, come on, come on. Fuck. Are you stuck? <laughs> Shit, fuck, fuck. come on, come on, come on! Okay. Lenny got in first. Fine, we just need a plan that's better than hers. Didn't her plan seem to be, grab shit I want? Shouldn't mm. be hard to have a better plan. I need to find the shutdown code for the nanobots. Our antidote, if you will. Oops. And free any people they may be using for experiments. Right. Plus, destroy all the nanotech I can find here, or they'll just go out and do it all over again. Wipe their research data, <laughs> and keep an eye on Lenny. Lenny wants their nanotech for her own uses. And I don't trust Lenny any further than I can throw her. It's unlikely you could throw her far. She outweighs you. <laughs> that is entirely true. I wouldn't put it past her to have some of her little friends show up, or use any nanotech she finds on other people just for shits and giggles. That does seem to be in keeping with her general personality profile. Yep, totally Lenny. Glad we agree. Oh, somebody's been knocked out already. I love how they have these new so-called enemies. God, I can't. Oh my goodness. And the camera is not where. You know what? Where are we gonna. We have to do this personally. Where was this guard down here? Lenny locked the door behind her. It looks like she used a pretty complex script on it. I could break it, but I can just as easily keep an eye on her. Yeah, not like I really wanted to be in her edifying company all that much. My, my, come on, the guy was standing right there. Oh, here we go.
Got it. Looks like they really are keeping prisoners. Oh, excuse me. Experiment subjects trapped here. Jesus. We knew they were doing that. Yeah, it's just hard to believe. What else did you find? Approximate locations where they store their nanotech, where they keep the majority of their research, and where we can find... Approximate locations where they store their nanotech, where they keep the majority of their research, and where we can find the deactivation codes for the nanobots. Looks like I'm good to go. Have fun yet, Jensen? Yeah, it's like a party, just with nanotech and people dying. Best day of my life. Nah, 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 no need to pout, just because I got in first, because I'm a better hacker than you. You keep believing that. Maybe it'll make it true. Oh, it's true, all right. I just needed you to be the muscle brawn, not brains. I mean, if I needed brains, I would ask your little friend. Josh, you mean? Josh, you mean? Dude, what the hell was with that? I was seriously worried you were about to molest him or something. Reminds me of someone I used to know. Somebody's got to be protected from all the shit snatches in this world. Wow, Lenny, that was almost sweet. Ah, fuck you. And that's the Lenny we all know and love. Looks like I have our first container of nanotech. What now? Find the valves on the container. Got them. Then you hack them and increase the internal pressure. And then shit blows up. All right, little robots. Time to go, boy. All right, little robots. Time to go, boy. Follow the pipes to find the valves and manual the pressure. All right. No, I can't interact with this. Uh oh, uh -oh. no. Free Follow the captives. pipes to find the valves and raise the pressure. Why can't I interact with these things? no idea what I'm even doing at this point. So how am I supposed to free these captives? Freed our buddies. Some of them look really confused. Yeah, well, a little robot scrambling up your brains can do that. But we are going to fix that. We sure are. Can you find them a safe path out of here? Make sure doors are open. On it. All right, let me not set off any more alarms. said that we got us a dead second intruder I oh, see the code now you, you are so good 
over here. What have you got for us? You too. The cure for our friends back at the homeless encampment. It should deactivate the nanites. Once they're inert, they'll pass out of the body harmlessly. You mean these guys are gonna be pooping out robots? Always keeping it classy, Wrench. I know I do. All right, can we interact with this now? We still cannot. Who I tell you? Overload pressure. Just got to turn the valves up to get enough pressure. What valves? I mean, I'm in front of these things, and you're trying to tell me these are not the right things. So, I guess the only other place is over here that we didn't go. That one right there. No, we've been there already. There's no interaction with these so-called pipes, whatever. Follow the pipes to find the valves and raise Follow the, the pressure. Follow the pipes to find the valves. So, all right. I think I did something with the the pipe. Here we go. So this, this just was not uh, very clear that I'm supposed to look for these valves. There we go. Now, can I interact with these things? Still no. What, is there more? Am I supposed to blow these things up, me? No, 
Oh, is there still more? Wait. Is... Yeah, there's still more. I mean, I don't understand why are these things highlighted if, if I don't have anything to do with them. So, somewhere up here, yeah, here we go. Now, there we go. Realize how much research went into this? How many hours? I realized they were experimenting on people illegally and killing them. Not all of them. And what are a few lives against thousands or millions against a cure for diabetes or epilepsy or cancer? Didn't think about that, did you, Boy Scout? For all you know, they're developing nanobots that can eat cancer cells and prevent it from spreading then they should go through medical trials, like all the chemo drugs and other experimental cancer treatments. And it's not like that's what you're here for. Oh yeah? How do you know? How can you know what matters to me? You a mind reader all of a sudden? You want to tell me you know my body better than I do? Or better than my doctor does? What? Shit. Hey, I didn't know. You have cancer? Nah, bitch. Just fuck it with you. Can you get through this before me? You're just gonna destroy all the research and tech, aren't you? Damn right I am. What they're doing is unethical. And it's not like the tech works. It's killing people. You destroy the research and all those deaths are in vain. You think on that. Oh, come on. They don't they don't make any of this easy. How on earth do I get to this valve? There. I think there we go. Finally! I'm not just gonna let you destroy all the nanotech. No way in hell. Why are you so into this stuff anyway? Why aren't you? Anyone with half a brain would be interested. I mean, of course, I'm pulled out both of you dead sex models. Okay. I blew up their nanobots and freed their prisoners. I've tracked down their backup servers and can make sure their data files are corrupted. Hey, good work. Now to get out of here. And I've tracked Lenny's path out. You need to retrace her steps and get out the back door. I can keep you from being detected that way. I can't get through Lenny's hacking. Still not enough. So if I can figure out where this is, I should be able to get through. Yeah, here we go. She's nearly out, Marcus. You need to hurry. Shit, she's gonna get away. I'll try to slow her down. <laughs> Good, man. I'll be there soon. We don't want Lenny running wild with shit tons of nanotech. She can't use it all on herself. She can use it on her followers. Or sell it. Y yeah, without any warnings that it may not be fully tested. I'm on it, Marcus. Hmm. So there's 
a door up here. I get my jumper through. Aha! Yeah, they really pulled out the puzzles this time. Hopefully this is the right room. Where's that box? Yeah, it is. Is that the nanotech? Mm-hmm. Mama found her babies. Can I see it? No, no time. Oh. Okay. Are you gonna fucking puppy dog me now? Oh, Jesus. Fine. Here. Take a look. Wow. There must be thousands of dollars of nanotech in there. <laughs> you are so cute. Try hundreds of thousands. Okay, show and tell's over. Gotta go. Hey, what the, was that? Yes. You didn't stop her? <laughs> you straight played her! Don't fuck with the hot sauce. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Yo! That's, that's like a line from a disco movie! Damn, that's my boy. Okay. It should pack a punch for the PR vid. Experimenting on the homeless, people dying, illegal nanotech? Yeah. Crazy shit. Within the next 10 years, you will be bombarded with the promises of nanotechnology. Miracle health solutions, anti-aging treatments, psychological tuning. The dream? By 2040, humanity may be rendered immortal. The cost? Installing a vulnerable operating system in your own body and handing over the controls to a corporation interested only in selling and maintaining nanotech. Corporations like Rensense. Testing has only just begun in its current form. And testing requires guinea pigs. Rensense took your homeless, tempest-tossed your wretched refuse and injected them with experimental nanotech. They ask them to sign away their legal protections in exchange for free medical care. DedSec has uploaded everything we know about this scam to your usual depots. We have given you the truth. Do what you will. Alright, wait for it. Wait for it. There we go, and we've got the achievement, Nano Triumph. Okay. Alright, so I don't think there's going to be any other chatter. This, this should be it. This concludes the Human Conditions DLC, and I have to say, 
the gameplay was a little bit frustrating because I, I was kind of like left out there not really knowing what to do and the other one with the the autop automata and the car and the hacking and the police chasing you all that stuff at the same time kind of made it not that fun so my recommendation is that the DLCs could probably be skipped unless you really I don't know re really enjoyed playing Watch Dogs I mean then it gives you another chance to continue on playing it but I, I just didn't like the way these DLCs were implemented I mean some parts of them were fun but more often it was frustrating rather than fun but anyhow we're done I have completed Watch Dogs 2 and I thank you all for watching and this is Hill and I'm out.